Link and Roy, today is the day that you are going to get your stitches out. Can you believe it? Can you believe that? And when I told him that this morning, he said, are they going to put a staple? No, he said nail. Are they going to put a nail in? Lincoln, they are not going to put a nail in at all. Okay? They're just going to take them out. Look up. Look up. They're going to take them out, and you'll just have a little line, and we'll just put stuff on it every day. Some needle spawn and a band-aid, okay? And then this summer, we'll put lots and lots of sunscreen on that. And guess what? When you were a little baby and you got your other stitches, we were in Hawaii when we had to take those out, and I had to take them out, and I will link that video. But then we had to put lots and lots of sunscreen on, and that's why that looks so good. So you look so handsome. Can you want to go in a truck? Is that where you want to go in? Is the truck is suburban? Do you like riding in Daddy's truck more or Mommy's suburban? Which one? Got the truck. The truck. That's right. That's right. Truth be told, so does Bonnie too. All his hair. This is all Olivia's hair. Ew. Look at that. That's disgusting. Get your stitches up, okay? Come here. I only have one cereal. <laughs> As opposed to your three bowls a day. This kid eats cereal all day long. He could eat cereal all day long. Huh? What's your, what's your favorite cereal? Fruities and what else? Uh, cocoa Puffs. You like the Cocoa Puffs? I don't know what crazy harebrain idea Bonnie got in her head last week, but we took the kids grocery shopping with us. That was problem number one. And we came home with like five different kinds of cereal. We buy two kinds of cereal, Life Cinnamon and Honey Nut Cheerios, and that's it. No, we came home with like a dozen different kinds. The kids have been in heaven all week eating their candy cereal. Hmm. They aren't candies. Yeah, well, they may as well be. Come on, bud. Dad, my shoes match my shirt. They do. They match your shirt underneath. Those were Cody's boots. Do you know that? Now they're no. now they're Lincoln's. No, now they're Boston. No, they won't fit him either, bud. Come on. Hey. Are you nervous about getting your stitches out? What did you ask me in the car? Are they going to bleed? What? Are they going to bleed? Are they going to bleed when they pull them out? Yeah. I don't think so, bud. I don't think so. But your bruise finally set in. Put it in your fingers. In your fingers. In between. Yep, yep, yep. On top. I have scissors in my hand, so it seems kind of scary, but you're not going to feel it. Do you feel it when you get hair cut? No. Okay, so you just hold super still. Relax your arms right here. Okay, got those in nice and tight, didn't I? I think I'm going to go switch scissors. Okay, you got to hold really still. If you hold really still, maybe we'll find a snack or treat or something. At the hospital cafeteria. Do you want to go to the hospital cafeteria? Or do you want to go to Maverick? Maverick. You want to go to Maverick? Okay, we'll go to Maverick. You were so brave. Was that scary a little bit? They had to tug at them quite a bit because they were pretty tight, but that means they were done really well. So now we just got some little strips for the next week. What do you get? A popsicle. Popsicle when it's 30 degrees outside. I wish Halloween was every day and I wish Christmas was every day. Lincoln, turn that down. Turn it down. And excuse me, what are you watching? Oh, okay. I thought he was not on what I thought he was on. <laughs> you scared me. Okay. Lincoln is in here binge watching our vlogs. <laughs> Lincoln, push pause. Push pause. Can you push? Okay. Push pause. Why do you like watching our vlogs? Because I like it. Yeah, but what do you like about it? Uh, 
the light Halloween and Christmas. You guys know my kids love watching our Halloween, Christmas, any type of holiday vlog. No, 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 no. It is actually really hard for me to hear my own voice. It just makes me cringe and want to die. But I came in here. I see you finished your popcorn. I came in here because I wanted to see your stitches got out. Can you believe that? Did they hurt coming out? Yeah. They did. Oh my gosh. I'm but so, they gave me a popsicle. That's what you told me, and a little um, cup, so that it, it wouldn't get a mess in the truck. It wouldn't get a mess in the truck. Ah. Can, can we not do stitches again, please? You smell like that popcorn, and I wanted it so bad. It was mine. I know, and look how empty the bag is. Not one tiny drop. Do you want to know where the drops are? Yeah, let me show you where those drops are. Ding, 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 ding. Look, <laughs> he was on my bed, moved to his bed, and oh, oh, cute. That's cute, Lincoln. Lincoln! Yeah. <laughs> you got popcorn all over my bed. Okay, I gen. Oh my gosh, lady! I'm not going to show you what she drugged through my house. She just. Can I unpause it? <clears throat> lady, go no, you are not having this anymore. <laughs> lady, do I usually let you have the iPad? No. Is it a special treat to have the iPad? If you cry when I take this away, I will not let you play with it. Okay. You do not cry when I take this away from you. Okay. Because that means that it's not something Lincoln should have. Do you understand? You can say, thanks for letting me use it, Mom. Thanks for letting me use, use it. it, Mom. Yeah. Yeah, you can say, thanks for letting me use it. And you can look forward to the next time I let you use it. But if you cry, I will not let you use it. Okay. Okay? It's not nice for you to throw a fit when I take it away. Okay. That's not nice, and I will not let you do that. Okay. Okay? Let me kiss. Okay, go put your stuff in the garbage. Um, what the heck was that? Okay. I... I, what, I used to be better about not letting the kids, um, I know my house is kind of a, it's fine. Um, I used to be better about not letting the kids get into my stuff using the iPad. Um, and I shouldn't have said play. As soon as I said, let you play with the iPad, it isn't to play with. At least I just don't like the verbiage of that. Um, I know... I just have such a, I have so many thoughts on this because I don't think we should just put an electronic in front of the kids and allow them to um, have it, but was I doing other things and I just wanted him to be, to not bother me? Yes, so I gave it to him. That is not something that I want to become a normal practice. I want it to be a special thing for him um, to have the iPad or like the Nintendo Switch. Those are not things, I don't want those to be my go-to things for my kids to be entertaining themselves with. My go-to is to send them in the backyard and play, to find something, to make something up. They do watch a lot of TV and I guess like I don't really mind that. Is it the same thing? Probably. Um, Anyway, I'm just some like, so I'm so torn on that whole situation as is the rest of the world. Some people don't care. It really does bother me and I don't like seeing other kids just like sitting in front of an electronic. I don't know. Being the perfect house mom that I am, I have my makeup on. The house is perfectly clean and look at this delectable after school snack that I am about to prepare for the rest of my kids when they get home from school. Wait, Joel. Joel, what are you, Joel, what are you doing? Come on, that's not the clip I told you to record. Okay, that was just a joke, but, <laughs> because my original plan, I was like, ooh, I'm gonna show them this like after school snack that I'm getting for the kids. It's healthy. 
for sure. I'm positive. <laughs> so last night after we launched, uh, we kind of had a little launch party with Allie and Tylan and Ellie and Jared, and they brought over these really yummy um, candied apples. And they were such a good treat. And I didn't feel too bad about eating it because... Is any of it for me? No, this is for the kids. We had ours last night and that was for our celebration. We're not going to eat bad right now. I feel like I should celebrate for not eating bad. <laughs> Cut these into pieces. They'll and, never know one of them's missing. And yes, I have to number them or like specifically count them out so each kid has the right amount or the equal amount, otherwise we will have fits thrown, so. One for dad. <laughs> that okay, one. we are going this to end the like vlog here, guys. Kind of, I don't know, this one seems a little bit offish. <laughs> All right, eat it. Is it mine? Can I have that one? Well, I am the perfect um, housewife, so yeah. Make my man a snack. <laughs> okay, guys, if you enjoyed today's video, give the vlog a thumbs up. If you are new to our channel, we would love to have you subscribe. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next time on the perfect day in Bonnie. The perfect life of Bonnie Olene. <laughs> <laughs>